Well, guys, good morning, good morning. It's me again, Ryan, and I'm back with another, I guess, okay and a bit stressful recap because I got stopped a few times and it was just a mess. And today will be a bit special because I'm going to show you a live trade with profit. Uh, since I decided to do this, I was just going to see I got stopped a few times because I was planning to show you a live profit. But the thing is, I got stopped a few times, and yeah, good thing I only traded 100 shares uh, because I was going to show it to you. I said something manageable, maybe 100 shares. Uh, yeah, let's have a quick look at our list. So today we have TGT, that's not my number one, and PDD, my number two. Like, both of them are good. So those are the ones that I was watching at a i kind of prefer trading that higher atr now like 60 cents atr is probably not ideal because it doesn't move a lot urbn i didn't choose because uh it's below 100 imrn i i blocked this because i get chopped a few times mgp i it was on my list mgp pdd and tgt cgc no lo low it's i kind of didn't like it the pre-market and yeah so volume pdd has 5 million target has like 1 million so they, they have like more more volume so more juice yeah so those three uh yeah let's see target mgp yep the chop it was chop but uh kind of held somewhere here it exactly held the pre-market low that's crazy they could have probably took along here and see that's like one atr so yeah but it's not not that good so pdd um it was choppy if it reached this area i could have shorted it here um but yeah it was was not moving a lot but let's focus on tgt yep i missed it see I should have held all the way here. This could have been like, a, I don't know, one, two, oh wait, one, two, three, four, five, six hundred dollar profit if I held. But I don't know what to say, man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's not how I, my target was just here and somewhere here. I, I don't normally think that the stock would probably move like this that much uh but yeah sometimes uh this this doesn't happen every day sometimes it happens but this only has two atr so who knows that this is going to move seven dollars right so <laughs> yeah uh looking at it but it's fine at least i'm green um that's that's not what we're aiming for uh that's not like red is not what we're aiming for so yeah let's uh let's watch Mm -hmm. so since since nothing moved on the first minute this is um this is what happened it's like uh -huh. so i entered long here uh because i mean this is not legit chx i don't really consider it the proper order if they want it they should have taken it here i only look at nasdaq most of the time like this one no so i the reason for me i took this is because it's in the pre-market um pre-market low and it moved like one atr already right not more than one atr so i said i'm sure this will be i'm sure everyone will just buy it by this this price so i entered um I had like since this is uh yeah hundred shares, so I probably made a hundred dollars here. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't take profit. I'm so dumb. Let's uh yeah. I was just so dumb. Now I end up red. Uh I almost made a hundred here, hundred dollars, but I stopped out. Yeah. What did they do? Wait one sec. Uh, let's fast forward. Mm. 
Yep. Entered long. Yeah. And I... When I entered long, that's really funny because when I entered long... I decided, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> Why... I might keep changing. So I kind of recognized um, my mistake there. I should have held. But the thing is, I don't want to give... I don't give back a lot. Uh, I stopped out here, uh, entered, and stopped out because I said, what the hell am I doing? And I re-entered. So this is the one that I re-entered. So, <laughs> so that's like 119.68. Yeah, that's my position. And I said, since I don't know what I'm doing and I'm up 50 cents now. So the first trade here, I lost about, I don't know. 80 80 dollars see like i i could have made 100 dollars here and just took it off but the thing is yeah i don't know man it's just messed up but yeah let's let's see and i patiently waited i said since i'm up now i'm i'm just gonna have it break and like go two to two two to one since i had a losing trade here i have to recover so i had to wait for two to one so i was very strict Whatever happens is either I'm going to reach this area or I'm going to get stopped. So let's fast forward a bit. So yeah. Um, so yeah, on my first trade, I lost about $80. So this one was $80, right? Um, then I have to recover it. I can actually take profit now to just recover for this one. Uh, $80 including this. I got stopped here. I stopped here immediately and I just re-entered. So this one's just probably a small um, small loss. So my, my target was 60, around 60, which I did. Yeah, so now I'm back to green. So I was thinking, should I... So they take everything off and leave. <laughs> I think that's what I did. Yeah. Oh no. I just taking taking partial a little bit. Oh, I think I waited until seventy seven. Yeah. So there you go. So as you can see, I have this called uh, diff. It's called difference. I really like it because. It will tell you immediately how much far are you it's good when it's super quick so i recommend you guys using this because um at the open you don't really know how much it moves so let's say your um your risk was 40 cents and you want to take 80 cents to two to one right like really quick so this is really helpful when you see 80 dollar 80, uh, 80 cents flash then get out so this that yeah so i'm out so yeah that was a quick profit there i uh, gained all my losses back and end up with 120 dollars so that's that's not bad right so yeah let's i think i did since i liked i liked the way i traded here i said maybe i'm gonna re-enter for a break of five day uh pre-market high so yeah let's let's wait Yeah, so I took another trade, just a really, really quick one, just to, to, sh to feel how it feels to trade with live, uh, live profit, showing the live profit. I'm sh serious. I'm seriously no, not going to do this anymore. <laughs> so the th the reason why I entered here is probably for the break of pre market high. So there's two pre-market here that I draw. It's this one and this is the highest. So my target was just here. A really tight stop. So 
I made about 30 bucks or something. I can't remember. So, wait one sec. Let's see, I think I showed it here. Yeah, there. So my, I, I traded small size because uh, I didn't want to give back a lot. I just, and I just want to show you, um, I just want to show you uh, five profit trade. So I think I'm going to get all out here. Yeah, just like that. So I've made about another 30 bucks there. Yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, I know everyone will like it. They like showing profit, but uh, just not not really comfortable showing profit every day. It's just it just messes me up. Yeah, I think I'm done here. It's and you know what? It went all the way to one twenty five fifty for a target. Like who knows? This is going to move like six dollars. Yeah. So yeah, that's about it. So I'm surely not going to do this anymore again tomorrow. Um, I don't want to show my profit. It's a bit too stressful and I don't want to talk about money. I just want to talk about my strategy, my entries and exit. That's that's the main important thing. So, you know, I could have made more if I en make, like, make, uh, enter more shares. But since this was a trial, then I'm going to just trade 100 shares. Uh, yeah. So, uh, that's it. Uh, have a good one, everyone. Uh, if you haven't, please, please, please subscribe to my channel. I have nine left before I reach my... I need nine more subscribers b before I sh uh, reach my 100 subscribers. Yeah, it's fun. It's fun journey. Uh, it's tough, but it's fun. So, yeah. Bye. Peace.